And welcome back, everyone. If you've noticed a significant increase in your grocery bill, you are definitely not alone. Food prices across the country have skyrocketed. Liza Danver is live right now to explain why. Well, the biggest culprit is the weather. There's a severe drought in California, and that's causing all the grocery prices to go up. So basically, for every $100 that you're used to spending at the grocery store now, expect to spend at least an extra 10 to 15 bucks. We need some salad. And we're not going to get that kind. We're going to get this kind. This kind's a little bit cheaper. Corey Shreves is the mother of three young children. Today, her two youngest, three-year-old Eli and five-year-old Jonah, help her pick out a few things for dinner from Dots Market. I spend about $500 a month on groceries. But her grocery bill wasn't always that high. It only started to climb recently. The most noticeable increase is at the meat counter and in the produce aisle. The healthier we eat, the more expensive it is, unfortunately. So. That's why I'm in the can aisle instead of the fresh food aisle, right? More than half of the produce sold in the U.S. comes from California, a state currently in the middle of a water crisis. The massive drought has forced growers to leave farmland unplanted. The U.S. cattle herd is also the smallest it's been since the 1950s. And less supply combined with rising gas prices can only lead to one thing spending more money at the checkout. For moms like Corey, the higher cost means smarter shopping. I'll search to see if there's a dressing on sale. And for her kids, it means they have to start making tough decisions. If you get the it's cupcakes, really we're not getting ice cream after dinner. It's your choice. Okay. Okay. They're so cute, aren't they? So there's a few things that you can do to save money. This is actually what Corey's going to start doing. She's going to start clipping coupons. Also, plan your meals according to what's on sale in the supermarket circular. Even if you don't get a newspaper, just do like what I did. Print one out online. Basically make what's for dinner, whatever's on sale. Live in the newsroom, Liza Danver, Fox 45 News.